when you want, Asier. Okay. Uh, in this in this circuit, we have two options. We have two push buttons, P1 and P2. And if we push P1, the circuit the circuit will do A plus, B plus, A minus, and B minus. Yes. And with P2, the circuit will do A plus, B plus, B minus, and A minus. Okay, and this would be the electrical circuit, yes? Yes. Uh, here we use a flanco for P1. What? Why? To, to the circle to do one cycle only. Okay, so you use flanco to do the sequence only once? Yes. And okay. here the same for the P2 button. Okay, yes. And then we use memories for this each, one. each button. MP1 and MP2. Yes. What for? Because we have to, the system have to know uh, which button are we using, which so button we have. It to means use. that during the sequence you need to maintain the information if you have push P1 or P2. Yes, that's Okay, so can we try it? Yes. So that will be a sorry this will be a, a cylinder. cylinder and b cylinder yes and this is p1 and this is p2 sorry can you tell me when p1 this and p2 okay so and can you push p1 first okay. so push again it doesn't work. Okay. so the, the 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 sequence is a plus b, b plus, plus a minus b minus yes. push again Okay, and now if you push P2, the sequence has to be A plus, B plus, B minus, A minus. Okay, push again. Okay, and the system does the movement only once, only once yes. although you maintain pushing P1 or P2. Yes. Try to maintain constantly push it, P1. Okay. And the system does the, 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 the sequence only once. And now push constantly P2. Okay, and the same. Okay, thank you, sir.